Hello everyone. In today's video we will be exploring the real life applications of trigonometry and friends you will realize that trigonometry is not just another chapter in maths but is also an invaluable tool that is widely used. So let's start. A very common application of trigonometry is to measure heights of objects. So friends you would have often wondered that how do we know the heights of tall mountains and ancient monuments and even skyscrapers well it's all made possible due to trigonometric concepts and i'll show you how suppose you want to find the height of a nearby building and you are at a distance of 20 feet away from it let's suppose your height to be 5 feet friends now just look at the top of the building and note down the angle that your line of sight makes with the horizontal let's suppose it is 30 degrees so did you see that you're getting a beautiful right angle triangle friends and wherever you have right angle triangles you can use all your trigonometric concepts so we can say that tan 30 is the opposite side upon the adjacent side that is ac upon bc so just substituting all the values that we have we'll find out that ac is 11.548 feet but the height of the building is going to be ac plus your height so it will be 16.548 feet so friends i hope you understood the concept that is used to measure heights of buildings and other structures now in case you're wondering how do i find the angle of inclination well friends there are numerous instances instruments that are available and that are widely used namely the clinometer or the inclinometer theodolite goniometer and you can even make diy clinometers so do go ahead try them out and find heights of some nearby buildings Another important application of trigonometry is in criminology. So friends, trigonometry is very useful in blood spatter analysis. Now that is nothing but the interpretation of blood stain patterns. Now this is done mainly by forensic experts to reconstruct the scene of crime or accident and also to determine where the blood originated from. So let's suppose the width of a blood stain is 8 mm and its length is 16 mm. Then they find the angle of impact now that angle of impact tells us the angle at which the blood hit the surface so in this case did you see you're getting a right angle triangle so you can use the trigonometric concepts so we can say that sin theta is opposite side upon the hypotenuse so sin theta is 8 upon 16 so your angle of impact is 30 degrees so with this angle the forensic experts can do further analysis so in this way trigonometry is very useful in criminology The next application of trigonometry is in construction. Friends, let's take an example where you have to construct a wheelchair ramp for a stage of height 5 feet. And suppose the ramp has to be at an angle of 10 degrees for maximum safety. Now you need to find the length of the ramp. So let that be equal to x. So friends, did you see that you are again getting a right angle triangle which means you can use the trigonometric concepts. So sin 10 degrees is nothing but the opposite side side upon the hypotenuse that is bc upon x so just need to substitute the values and you will see that x is 28.8 feet that is the wheelchair ramp length is 28.8 feet and friends this is just one of the numerous ways in which trigonometry is so useful in construction Trigonometry and astronomy are inseparable and trigonometry is very widely used over there especially to measure the distance of stars from the sun. So suppose friends you want to find the distance between sun and a particular star let's call that distance as d and now we already know the distance between sun and earth to be one astronomical unit which is nothing but approximately 150 million kilometers. Now when the distance between the sun and the star and the sun and earth when they are perpendicular to each other at that time you need to observe the star and note down the angle of inclination let that be theta and let's say that that theta was 60 degrees so friends did you see that again you are getting a right angle triangle over here so you can use the trigonometric concepts so we'll say that tan theta is opposite upon adjacent which is d upon one astronomical unit so for this case we'll take theta as 60 just need to substitute the values and you'll see that the distance between the sun and the star is 1.7321 astronomical unit so friends you can just imagine how important trigonometry is in astronomy 
Moving on to the next application, trigonometry takes video gaming to the next level. Let's see how. Suppose friends, in a game, if a character is moving at a certain velocity, say v meters per second, then while actually writing the code, we need to split this velocity vector into two components. One is the horizontal component or v cos theta and the other is the vertical component or v sin theta. So by manipulating the values of v cos theta and v sin theta, we get the net velocity vector of the object. So knowledge of trigonometry is very much needed while writing the codes of these programs. So trigonometry is indeed handy in video gaming. The next application of trigonometry is in navigation. So friends, let's suppose a scenario where you have to measure how far a ship is from the lighthouse. Let's say the lighthouse is 60 meters in height and from the lighthouse you are observing the ship and note down the angle of depression as say 20 degrees. Let BC be the distance of the ship from the lighthouse. So friends, did you see that again you are getting a right angle triangle here? So again you can use trigonometry and say that tan theta is opposite upon adjacent which is AB upon BC. So just substituting the values we will find that BC is nothing but 164.83 meters. So the distance of the ship from the lighthouse is 164.83 meters and this is just one of the many ways in which trigonometry is useful in navigation. The next application of trigonometry is in music. Now that's surprising but true friends because music is nothing but sound waves and sound wave can be represented by this equation f of t equal to a sine 2 pi omega t where f of t is the frequency of the wave, a is its amplitude, omega is the angular velocity and t is the time. So by manipulating the values of angular velocity t and a you can make the wave taller, wider or narrower and sound Sound engineers use this property to create computer generated sounds and a lot of trigonometry is used to create digital audio. So trigonometry is indeed very useful in music. Last but not the least, trigonometry is very useful in economics. So friends, the main property of trigonometric functions as you might have observed is that they are very cyclic in nature. So this property is used in finance and econometrics while creating marginal utility curves. Also the Tellier's solution and Fourier series are used in finance and economics and they both use trigonometry. So in this way trigonometry is very useful in economics. So friends, I hope you found the video useful. If so, do consider subscribing to my channel. Do like and share the video and do leave your comments in the comment section below. So till we meet again next time, take care. Bye.